controversy about the Garda Commissioner, uh, the financial scandal at Templemore and the position of the Justice Minister, Breed Smith. Uh, do you simply want to clear out at the top in the justice system and maybe the Minister to go to? Well, I, I don't think that uh, when you have a scandal of this nature and, and, and it keeps coming back and coming back and coming back and I don't think it's going to go away by any manner of means, there's obviously a lot of um, skeletons in the cupboard that need to be cleared out. And it isn't just down to one person, it's down to the whole institution. Um, some people call it a culture. I think it's governments. And I think there's a historical context to it, which is that this state, more than most states, heavily relied on the utter and total cooperation of the police. So there was no healthy tension between the two, uh, the body politic and the, and, and the security services, for want of a better word, of, of Angartha Shia Khanna. There, there hasn't been a healthy tension because of the, um, the the issue of the North and the troubles and the existence of, of paramilitaries that both Fianna Fáil and Fianna Gael down through the years completely relied on them. They had the and heavy they had gang, they had the stand behind them rock solid. And they stood behind them rock solid. And even when you think about it, all of the pay problems we've had over the last few years, the first one they give in to is the Garda. They found 40 million immediately right. to sort them out, but they can't find Mind 9 or you, 10 million to keep bus air the afloat. The record will show it didn't stop Jerry. In midst of all this, there is human suffering. There is the suffering of the whistleblowers that has seemingly been endless. There's the suffering of the people who were wrongly uh, taken to court and accused of, um, you know, uh, uh, driving uh, penalties and all imposed against them. And then there's that young woman whose family have been utterly devastated by the video going up online. And th th there's human consequences to all of this. And that's what I think we should bear in mind. It's not just about politics. There's human consequences to it. And if Brian Hayes is saying he agrees with me, then why not go the At whole nine point. yards and agree with me to say that the whole fish is rotten from the head and it needs to be cleared out? Because that's just cheap, but as well as secure a victory in the first 10 minutes. Breed Smith? Well, I thought the, I was there and I thought the whole atmosphere around it was quite an anti-climax because there was this hullabaloo and great lead up to uh, his, his uh, addressing the oil and it was all, there was an air of excitement about the place and then he says on the one hand, you know, Ireland's very important to us, we love you very much but there are going to be penalties for Britain and that will impact on the question of a hard border and tariffs and all being imposed and I was absolutely delighted when Richard challenged him on the record of the European Union in terms Richard of Barrett. Yeah, sorry, Richard Boy Barrett, um, my colleague, challenged him on the record of the of the European Union because it was gone unsaid. This week, 250 migrants drowned trying to escape from Libya where they were being tortured and raped and where the European Union has done a deal with this very unstable uh, country with three different states in existence and has handed over 200 million to hold on to migrants within the borders of Libya. A similar deal to what they did with Turkey with less money. And we have heard the witnesses from Medicine Sans Frontier who have told us that they're actually the slave trade is alive and well in Libya. They're actually selling people uh, to and fro in markets on the basis of their physique. Distasteful. And then there was also the financial bomb threat to the Dublin authorities when they, we talked about burning the bondholders. That cannot be forgotten. And therefore, Richard's question was, can we trust you? Are you going to impose a hard border on us? Are you going to impose tariffs on us? And are you going to leave us isolated? But and we need an answer to those things. And we also need a vote on, on the deal when it comes out. Yeah, but these are all questions that are... Looks like there's going to be pay restoration gradually uh, brought about. Um, the, the, the reaction on all sides seems to be fairly calm uh, to this Kevin Duffy report. Yeah, well, the pay talks haven't started yet. And indeed, the uh, minister, Pascal Dunne, who still has to stand in front of the Doyle, um, as he's obliged to do every year and renew the FEMPI legislation. And I'd just like to remind listeners, this is the longest standing emergency legislation in the history of the state. It's longer than the emergency legislation that was brought in uh, during the Second World War. And it has been renewed every year despite uh, since the election, despite the slogan of Fine Gael saying we're in recovery, we're in recovery. We're in recovery for everybody except public sector workers. And for teachers to work, teachers and nurses in particular, to work alongside colleagues doing exactly the same job for 250 grand over the course of their lifetime, less is absolutely outrageous. It's riddled with inequality. And the FEMPI legislation should go and the public sector pay talks should not be used as a big stick to beat them up with over so-called gold-plated pensions, which is what is getting at the core of this is we're going to penalise your pension, we're going to take more money off you, we're going to make the hours that you've worked for free during the crisis a permanent feature of your life. And that's where the real showdown is going to be, Cormac Lucy. It's one of the areas where the showdown was at the end just, of the day, at the end of the day, most just people the will want world. to do. Most to people teachers, will want to do a deal. I talk to and we, teachers and, we can and nurses solve that on a problem, daily basis, but you don't want that problem solved. Well angry yeah, they are well angry about working yeah. alongside yeah, each other that. and being treated and completely differently. Fempi can be. Fempi can be.